Hey y'all, y'all can see me. The lighting, it's popping, it's good. Get it how I live it. I live it how I get it. Come to and get it. I pull it with a lemon. Not cause she ain't living. It's just the eyes get acidic. And this ain't a scrimmage. Girl, only one in the world, OTBL, and I'm back with another video. So, this is gonna be a quick video on how I slick back my natural hair. I look like this because it's literally just got home and I was like hey let me make a video before I settle down and go to bed and edit stuff and stuff blah 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 so yeah I'm gonna show you guys how I slick down my edges so if you want to see how I do that just keep on watching all right so you are gonna fling off this hat beware Y'all ready? Y'all sure y'all ready? Y'all ain't ready. Like, y'all ain't ready. Okay, I forgot. So, my hair. My hair have been back in one all day, so it's kind of already slicked back. Not really. It looking rough. But anyway, so usually I'd start off by spraying my hair with some um, water mixture. Just spray the permit on my hair. And whether you want a side part or no part, it's up to you. So you're gonna part your hair. I'm gonna do a side part first. I'm gonna part your hair wherever you want it. Alright. So what I do, I dip my hair, my brush in the gel. And then I just brush it back like so following with my hands, well my fingers, and then do the same on the other side. And you want to make sure that you have a hard brush. My brush is, brush is kind of soft, unfortunately. Alright, so when you have that nice and brushed out, you're going to take a hard duty scrunchie or whatever scrunchie you have, and you're just going to pull your hair back. Pull it back. And I only tied it three times. Usually I tie it tighter than that, but I guess that'll do. Okay. You want to make sure that you brush the back of your head too. You don't want it looking peasy. So, alright. So I take some gel. My phone was literally laying, resting on the gel, so I had to like get some out and then slap this on. So you're gonna put that on your head like so. Then I'm gonna take this small toothbrush and I need to get a new one because this one is kind of old. And I just brush that as if I'm brushing it with a big brush. And then I like to do a little swoop motion right here. A swoop. And maybe another swoop if my hair is feeling good. You literally just brush it how you want to. Alright, so I'm going to take this little scarf and I'm going to wrap this on my head like so. While this is, you know, setting my edges into place, I'm going to put my hair in a bun. So for my bun, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna try and make like a messy bun and wrap it around 
you're gonna get a hair tie like so a black scrunchie and I just like wrap it around because my hair isn't like extremely long my hair ain't even long my hair is medium short to medium so that's what I consider so I just kind of wrap it around and then taking the scrunchie I tie it once and depending on what type of scrunchie I have like how stretchy the scrunchie is I might tie it twice I might tie it once it depends so So it's a blend, is it? It's like how I want it to be. I'll go in with a bobby pin. So I'm going to go in the bobby pin. My eyes red. I know why. Y'all like so tired. I gym today. I had a 10 o'clock class after the gym. So they were long. <laughs> that doesn't sound like a long day, but I know I just tired. So I'm going to make sure this bun is how I want it to be. Sometimes you have some parts that are sticking out of the bun. I don't really care if some parts sit on the bun. I like messy buns, so. Okay, not too messy. This one, this this being unruly. This is just being rude and disrespectful. So I'm gonna take another bobby pin. And I'm gonna put in this section right here. What is this white thing in my hair? I don't have the strength to take you off. Okay, I got it. Okay, I like this one. This one is kind of cute. Alright, so because I'm not really going anywhere after this, I'm going to take this off now. Usually I would leave it on until I'm halfway to my destination or until I get to where I'm going. But let's take it off. Right hair, for example, is look a little poofy to me. I don't know if you ever see it, but when something is looking a little poofy after I have already laid down my edges, I take a bobby pin and I just pin it back. I just try to pin it as flat as possible, like right here, just to like flatten it out a bit. Alright, so my edges are exactly <laughs> as slick as I have them, but I think y'all get the picture. That is basically how I slick down my edges. I might do a, another um, slick, slick bun video because this one is kind of all over the place, but this is generally how, oh what are you? This is generally how I would do my hair in a low sleek bun. I wish I had my glasses so I could saw this because usually I look weird with my hair like just slipped back in the bun. So yes, this is the bun. My little lock in the back. I also just used the back of my hair. Didn't really care to brush it. This is the next side. I hope y'all can see. So, yeah, that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below letting me know what kind of videos you want to see. Whether it be hair tutorials, whether it be vlogs, whether it be challenges, whether it be whatever y'all want to see. Just hit me up and let me know. Yeah, I'm going to end this video right here. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you guys in a minute. Hey, wanna be my baby. Hey, come down, let's see I, hey. Hey, I'm a car trying to see my baby.